Hi everyone, my name is John Espy. I want to show you a method of connecting an accelerometer to a servo, but without using a microcontroller or writing any code. So here's the circuit completely built. What we're doing is we're taking the square output of this accelerometer, making it an analog voltage, and using it to control the servo through the 555 timer chip. This MX2125 is a MEMSIC dual-access accelerometer available from Parallax. I recommend reviewing the datasheet. The first step is to build our 555 timer chip servo controller. This creates a 1 to 2 millisecond pulse every 20 milliseconds or so. Now to control the rotation of the servo, we can attach a potentiometer to the control pin, which is pin 5 of the 555. When we lower the resistance to the control pin from the 5 volt supply rail, we increase the voltage seen at pin 5, increases the pulse length, and here it is in action. And here on the oscilloscope you can see that the signal pulse length changes between 1 and 2 milliseconds. We'll also take a look at the output waveform of the accelerometer. Tilting the accelerometer in one direction increases the pulse length, while tilting the accelerometer in the opposite direction will decrease the pulse length. Now the data sheet also explains you can create a DC voltage from this output voltage by creating an RC low pass filter. So we'll build that up on the prototyping board and check that out as well. It produces this triangular wave with 1.6 volts of change. Now I need to be flat line, so we increase the capacitance and we can accomplish this. The next step is to bias a transistor to source voltage from pin 5 of the IC. Then connect our accelerometer and voila! you can control the rotation of the servo. Just duplicate the circuit for the second axis of the accelerometer. Here's the complete circuit diagram. Thank you for watching.